there's nothing like cruising along at pace with the wind in your hair, weather permitting of course. We took a look at a couple of convertibles from the compact executive class. The Audi A5 faces off against the BMW's 3 Series. What's immediately apparent is the difference in roof construction. The Audi comes with a fabric top, like those preferred by die-hard convertible fans, while the Beamer has a folding metal roof. With rain a frequent factor in certain parts of the world, we gave the two models a proper bath both prove totally impervious to water and emerge from the car wash both clean and dry inside. The BMW 3 Series has been available as a convertible for over two decades. The fourth and latest generation was launched two and a half years ago and it certainly lives up to BMW's old slogan, the ultimate driving machine when it comes to dynamic performance. The suspension is excellent and the handling sound, regardless of whether you pick the six-speed manual transmission or the automatic. The 3 Series comes with a choice of seven engines, three run on diesel and four on gasoline. Outputs range from 170 to 306 horsepower. The Audi A5 convertible likewise has seven different engine options and again four gasoline and three diesel fueled. The horsepower range here is between 160 and 265. We tested the two liter diesel version fitted with a six speed manual transmission. The Audi gets top marks for the suspension and road holding. Driving the A5 convertible provides a lean, mean but ultimately very comfortable ride. The A5 convertible was launched in May 2009, succeeding the open top A4, but the smooth mover has also shaken up the segment. The A5 cuts a fine coupe-like figure with the roof up, but when you decide you want a bit more breeze, it takes just 15 seconds for the fabric top to disappear into a compartment above the trunk. But retracting the roof does not make it look any less elegant. The rear has a chunky beefcake look. The broad front, meanwhile, is dominated by the single frame grille. The interior is nicely laid out and the materials and workmanship met our high expectations. Neck level heating makes open top driving a pleasure, even when temperatures are on the chilly side. Of course, getting into the back seats is a lot easier with the roof down, and the single seats mean there's plenty of space for four people. Rear passengers can also look forward to adequate leg room. The fourth generation of the BMW 3 Series features a metal roof that folds together in a smooth, syncopated ballet of mechanics before disappearing into the trunk. The whole complicated process takes 23 seconds. Seen from the side view, the 3 Series makes a very sporty impression, thanks not least to the rake back windscreen. As ever, the BMW front is dominated by the signature kidney grille. Large lights adorn the rear. As with the Audi, the Beamer has an engine start-stop button that also helps to save energy. The 3 Series interior features high-quality materials and upholstery, and the seats provide solid side support. Taking your place in the rear seats is likewise child's play. The front seats can be shifted back and forward at the touch of a button. The BMW has plenty of space and generous leg room. 
Both models performed well in roof retraction, but when it then comes to loading up the trunk with our shopping, the difference couldn't be clearer. Easy accommodation of two crates of water in the Audi seems like mission impossible with the BMW. 320 liters of cargo capacity sees the A5 topping its class. The task is a lot trickier with the BMW. The retracted roof makes it very difficult to access the trunk and fit in reasonably large items of cargo. First, you have to bring the roof back up, which is time consuming. Only then is it possible to push back the lid and free up the 210 liters of space for those crates. The A5's fabric top versus the 3 Series folding metal roof. The far more convenient cargo setup might tip the balance towards the Audi, but otherwise there's little to separate the two convertibles, which are both great fun to drive. Prices for the Beamer start at just over 41,000 euros in Germany. While the basic version of the Audi sells for 37,600 euros.